I'm Deputy Mayor Tom Gribben. I'm here with Hamilton First Council candidate Jonathan Oliva. Jonathan, welcome. Thanks for being here with us. Thanks so much for having me, Tom. What made you want to run for town council? When I came back from college, I got involved in the Hamilton Sons of Italy. I uh, started to get involved in some of the, the, uh, the activities downtown. Uh, my fiance teaches at the ECC. She runs the theater program there. She does the yoga club there. Uh, I got involved in planning and zoning board. So we're very involved in the town and we just really, really enjoy being it. And uh, I think it's just always something that I really wanted to do. What drew you back to want to live in your hometown again? You know, the town's developed in a lot of ways and you can take you know, a, a, a great coffee shop and great restaurants and a great downtown and a great theater and you can take all these things and you can put them in just, you know, nowhere USA. And they're all great things, but without the people, they really don't hold that much value. So it really, Hamilton, I think, is, is all about the people, the volunteerism effort, uh, the tight-knit community. And that was what I wanted to be a, a part of. Why Hamilton first? What attracted me to Hamilton first are the three core values. Um, Hamilton first is, most importantly, in my opinion, it is for Hamilton as a whole. Um, and the way that they do that is they don't really get involved in upper level politics. That's the second thing. We keep the upper level politics to someone else and we truly worry about what is Hamilton. Uh, the issues and the, the successes of all the things that are Hamilton. Um, and third, they're open to everyone being a part of it. What are some skills that you bring to town council? And I think that my background in engineering and planning is very suited for assisting the town on the, the uh, planning and zoning board side. I've done a lot of pipeline operations, I've put a lot of pipe in the ground, a lot of road reconstruction, a lot of valve maintenance, a lot of metering. Um, so I think that really kind of also goes into the water sewer aspect, that goes into the, the public works aspect. What are some things that you believe that the town needs? For a while, a lot of people were saying that people would go to college and they wouldn't come back. Right. They would go somewhere else. We're starting to attract that group to come back. So I think it's really important to energize the next group of individuals. Uh, the individuals like myself who are in their, their early 30s who are coming back to town, uh, moving to town, putting roots in town, having kids in town. Energize those individuals to, to really start to make some, some positive improvement. Donovan, thank you. Thanks so much, Tom. I really appreciate it.